Four years ago, St Mary's, Crookwell and 55 other Catholic schools began an education revolution. Word one is calculate. What word? Calculate. Embracing the science of learning, an approach centred on understanding how student brains absorb knowledge. Read word two, get ready. Four. After three years of the new lessons, the school saw a tenfold improvement in reading. We do believe this is a, as a result of our commitment to the science of learning, the science of reading. And now this is the name of us. It's so different to more theoretical approaches taught at most universities that the entire teaching workforce of 1500 was retrained. Unfortunately, too often, university graduates are graduating, able to write essays about all sorts of things, but not able to respond to the needs of students in terms of how their brains learn. Teaching student Bianca Benjamin agrees. There's been a lot of focus on writing essays and not that much on the practical skills that I'll need to help deal with student behaviour. Her recent practical teaching placement at a bush school did not go well. I was completely overwhelmed and I was pretty close to just giving up on teaching then and there. And we've got the ministers. Federal Education Minister Jason Clare wants to change experiences like these, mandating universities teach core content similar to the science of learning. We've got a teacher shortage crisis in this country at the moment. And there are a bunch of reasons for that, but one of them is this. Uh, we know that only 50% of students who start a teaching degree finish it. The Australian Education Union says the real problem is teacher salaries and underfunding of public schools. It's angry they weren't addressed in the report. And a wave and a smile, everyone. Classroom change is on the way. Connor Duffy, ABC News.